Hey guys, welcome back once again to my channel. Okay, no, that was way too. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back once again to my YouTube channel. For those of you that don't know me, hi, I'm Elisa. Nice to meet you. If you don't want to miss this beautiful face and this beautiful, gorgeous content, um, subscribe to my channel and don't forget to like. So, you know I don't like talking. Well, I do like talking, but not for the intros. For today's video, we're going to be doing the famous um, clean makeup from TikTok. If you don't know, here it is. This is what it's all about. As you can see, as you can tell. Um, I feel like this is a new trend, or it was, or it is. I don't know, because I'm confused now. But, um, yes, that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be trying this new thing of clean makeup, which I feel like they should rename it into something else. Because it's like, it's makeup, but it's not makeup. But it is makeup, because you have makeup on your face. But okay. Um, let's stop talking. Get let's get straight into the video because I feel like this is gonna be a fun experience because we're gonna be trying this. Cause even though I don't use makeup every day, I wear makeup. And when I wear makeup, it's like honey, I wear makeup. If you know what I'm trying to say, I go in. In full coverage. So let's see how this turns out. And um yeah, let's just stop talking. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, okay? So let's continue to watch. Don't forget to subscribe. Okay, so the definition for a clean makeup look, we can find it in Google. And I want to search it up. I have my, the laptop right here. I'm going to put it on the screen. So let's read because we need to understand what are we going for because it's like i kind of i have seen it but i haven't seen like in follow up steps because again this is not like my go-to makeup type of look so let's read so it consists of seamless and glowing skin a lifted highlight which i love sun kiss bronzer and blush i don't do that too much full and fluffy brows as well as a plump and glossy lip. I like those two. I already like it. I'm already liking it. I'm already liking it now. Glowy skin though, I'm gonna have a problem with that because my face is way too oily. And if I don't do a, the type of foundation that is matte, it's gonna look like if I put oil on my skin. So it's like that glowing skin. Mm. But we're gonna try. We're not gonna say no. We're already being too negative. Let's stop being negative. Let's not be negative. Um, It says that it's compared to Instagram obsession with heavy contouring and intr intricate cut crease eyeshadow looks. It could be considered a touch more minimal. We're gonna be doing what I do, but the opposite of what I do, cause this is describing what I do the most, which is cut creep. I don't do having contouring, contouring though. I don't do that too much. I do it, but not a lot. So, okay, whatever. I feel like it's simple, right? It's, it's simple. Yeah, it is simple. Let's read the steps. Let's get into it. Cause it said how to do clean makeup look for beginners. So this is good, cause I feel like for this type of style, yes, I'm kind of handle. It says slick your hair back. I mean, it's not bad, but it's out of my face, right? I'm not gonna do a bun. I'm not gonna do a bun because I don't have like a strap shirt and I don't like. Yeah, let's do that. I'm not gonna do that. Then it says use a luminous primer, concealer, and foundation. God damn it, I went straight to the point, honey. Apply a cream blush and bronzer. Four, swipe some lengthening mascara over your lashes. Ooh, we're not doing falsies. Set your brows with brow gel. And for last, apply a high shine lip gloss. Okay, okay, I feel like it's okay. It's okay, right? It's okay. I feel like it's, it's good. It's okay. Guys, this is super easy. I feel like this is gonna be so easy for us. We're gonna do this in one, two, three. Like, this video is gonna be short, so let's get to it. Let's let's just get to it because this is super easy. Okay, first, the hair, I feel like we're not going to count the hair step because it's like, I might do it. You know what? Let me go change shirt. Let me go change shirts and I'm going to be right back because I feel like when I have this type of shirt, I don't like putting my hair back because it's like, let me get a shirt. Let me be right back. So, I am back even with the slick. I changed my shirt. Yeah, because you guys couldn't notice. <laughs> 
Okay, so now, since we have the step one done and checked, let's go in with the second step, which now I completely lost these. So let's just look for it again. Here you go. How, okay, so we have step one checked. Slick your hair back. I mean, slick. Step number two, use a lumin luminous primer, concealer, and foundation. Now, I feel like we have a problem with number two because how I explained in the intro or like at, at first I have a really oil face oily face texture however you say it skin type so I don't have no foundation that is not matte so what we're gonna be doing we're gonna be using concealer for my whole face and for primer the only primer that I have that is not matte or that is doesn't give like a matte finish is the milk Primer, concealer, and foundation. We don't have the foundation, concealer, and the primer. So let's go in with the primer. Even though I feel like I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to mix it because I don't think this is gonna be not matte. I don't. I'm, I'm not sure. But let's just go for it. Oh, I put too much. I put too, too much. Too much. I put too much. So let's start with the forehead. Now, why did people came up with this? <laughs> it's like if you just wanna. If you just want to do your makeup and not use a lot of makeup, just call it like a little bit of makeup type of thing. So, there you go. So, primer out of the way, honey. Since we don't have the foundation, let's just go in with the concealer. I am going to be using the Maybelline and the this, which I just bought. Where did I buy this? I don't remember buying this, but I have it. So, yay! So, since this is not like a matte concealer. Wait, is there concealers that are matte? Let me search that up. So there is matte concealers. So this one is not a matte concealer. It's not finished, but I just have that little. We're gonna waste it here, you know? So let's just go in. Cause this is what we're doing, right? Like this is what you're supposed to do, right? This is what you're supposed to do, right? <laughs> Bro, what that guy look like? So let's put a little bit, tiny bit right here that way we don't have like to go with it again you know what i'm trying to say you know what i'm trying to say i look so cute <laughs> can never can never where's my mirror let's go in honey the primer was like i'm here to stay okay i wet the sponge let's try this again okay next time this is not going according to plan okay well the brush is better even though i don't know why i'm doing like a brush review and about that okay it's giving, I don't know what, but it's giving. We're done with step two, two, two. We're done with step two. Now, step number three will be apply a cream blush and bronzer. You know what's the problem here? That I don't have, I do not have, I do not own liquid blush, nor liquid bronzer. So what we're gonna be doing, we're gonna be using lipstick. But I feel like, mm, I don't know. I don't know. Should I use matte or no matte? This looks just a tiny bit more. Because on camera, it looks like I have. But then here, I don't. And I feel like here, it's okay. Here, there. There. That's better. That's cute. I'm starting to believe that trends are not for everybody. Yep. Trends are not for everybody. Because it's not look looking good. Mmm. <laughs> Let's not be negative. Let's not be negative. We can do this. We can do this. Now, for the bronzer part though, I don't know what I should do. Wait, I think I have to wait. Okay, so for this, let's see if we do this. I don't think this is gonna turn good, but again, let's not be negative. Let's not be negative. Oh. Okay, okay, not that bad. Ooh, bad, 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 bad. Let's see this side. So let's just go in. Tell the difference is cute. A little bit on the outside though. You can see the difference. And if you don't, you was blind, sis. You was blind. I'm back. So, as you can see, we're already on step what? On step what? Three. Three. No. Four. 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 We're already done with step four. 
cuatro. Vamos a paso número cinco. Cinco. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> so, I don't have, now that I don't have, for me, it's like, if you could see, I have way too much brows, right? So, it's like, for me just to do this, I'm fine. You see what I mean? Like, I don't need to do nothing else, but because I don't want people to be like, you, st um, like, you, you skip a, t uh, uh, don't I need you? You skip a, a step. So, let me just do it. Let me just do it. So there you go. We're done with step five. So now we have to add a what does it say? High shine lip gloss. So I have two that for me are really like really high shine lip gloss. So it would be the um, I think this is Maybelline. Yeah, this is Maybelline. Maybelline the lifter gloss and then the collar pop. Collar, color pop, and so glassy. I'm sorry for the noise, but people here forgot I'm filming. So I'm gonna be adding this for a little bit of color because I feel like if I only put this, you're not gonna see nothing. So, <laughs> see what I mean? So you guys, this is the final result. Now, I feel like my face is not glowy enough. Or probably because I'm in here. But yeah, this is the final look. We already did all the steps. Now, I don't feel like this trend, this look is for everybody. If you know what I mean. I don't feel like it's for everybody. I like it though. I really like it. Like on the get-go, like on your daily basis type of look. I like it for that only. But this is not the type of look I'm going to choose to do serious business. Like going out, depends. If it's for brunch, yeah, I'm down for it. But I don't know. Yeah, it's like it's like every trend. I feel like every trend in the makeup <laughs> section, in the makeup, yeah, I don't feel like every makeup trend is for everybody. I don't feel like it's for everybody at all. So it's like, I like this. And you could do it if, it, if, if like, you think it might look good on you. But try it out. You never know. What if you end up liking it? What if you end up, if you end up liking the side you did it, the way you did it? You could change a bit, right? So thanks to the girlies from TikTok that show us, like, this new little cute thing, like, for our daily, our daily basis type of makeup look. I feel, like, really cute, right? It looks cute. You cannot lie. It looks cute, right? Say it with the words that would declare you. No, no, she. Say it right. I said she. No, say it. Does it look good or not? Does it look good or not? Yeah. She said it looks good. So let me leave it here because Austin is being a. How do you say it? Austin is being a loud baby boy. But on a serious note, I hope you li you really like this um style. I hope you like it and I hope you feel like this is for you and I hope you, you, you try it. And if you try it, comment down below how did it went. You like it, you didn't like it, you like the glow, you didn't like the glow because it's not for everybody again. So this is it. Again, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you forgot, subscribe to my channel. And then that's it. Bye.